everyone! Well, we finally made it through our hectic three-month work schedule, and luckily we waited until now to get sick. This is the first time being sick for both of us in over two and a half years, so please forgive our funny voices, our runny noses, and our coughs. So, I guess we have some catching up to do, don't we? Well, after picking up our new Tab 400 and driving halfway across the country, we arrived in the Tetons where we had two back-to-back -back photography workshops. And we have to admit, it felt great to finally be back in the mountains after being away from the Rockies for so long. No matter how many times you've seen the Tetons, they never get old. And it's even better when you get to show an entire group of students this gorgeous place for their first time. The Tetons are beautiful any time of year, but we tend to prefer the springtime when the water is flowing and the flowers are all blooming. The Tetons are also beautiful any time of day, but if you want truly stunning views of these mountains, it's not that easy. Our photo workshops are full of early wake-ups, like three o'clock in the morning-ish, driving up to an hour, standing in the cold, late nights, and maybe even a little sleep deprivation. But we've never had a student complain at the stunning views they get to see as a result of this effort. Despite all of the early wake-ups and long days, we still spoil our students a little bit. Our orientation meeting includes a group meal cooked over an open campfire by yours truly. But it always seems like our time in the Tetons is over in the blink of an eye. Our second workshop ended around midday on a Friday and we had to book it nine hours to get to my parents' house in Fort Collins, Colorado. We had just one full day to do laundry, get everything packed, and jet off to Ohio for the third annual U Camp Rally put on by New Camp. The last time we were at the factory was a blur as we were moving into our new Tab 400. So we were really excited to have five full days to hang out with people we knew and meet a bunch of new people. U Camp is such a great time with events from a potluck to a wine and cheese night, a swap meet, and even tech talks. But perhaps my favorite night of the week was when Kendrick and I got to premiere the recap video we made of our Alaska to Mexico trip. Last year at UCAMP is where we premiered our announcement for the trip, so it was just fitting. But once again, we had to jet off. So after one and a half hours of sleep, we woke up at 1.30 in the morning to head to Cleveland and go to the airport. Because we had to get back to celebrate my parents' 50th wedding anniversary. You heard me right. 50 years. And what kind of daughters would my sister and I be if we didn't throw them a party? Now it's finally time to get a little rest in the Colorado mountains, catch up on some work, and get Little Bear and Blanca a little more organized. I promise a video tour of Little Bear is coming soon. So make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel or follow us on Facebook or Instagram at Mandy Lee Photo. And this week's cheers goes out to Phil and Anita, who gifted us a delicious bottle of bourbon from the great state of Wisconsin. So, here's to another week on the road. Love and light. You know, I hear whiskey is a cure for the common cold. Worth a shot.